In this video, we'll show you how to configure the digital inputs and outputs of the Watson Marlow 530 case pump. With the pump on, we will begin by configuring the digital inputs. Select Menu. Select Control Settings. Navigate to Configure Inputs and select. Here we can see the list of digital input options. In this video, we'll be demonstrating configuration of the start-stop input. This is also referred to as remote stop or run stop. Select your input. Using the arrow keys, you can choose to disable input in manual mode. This can allow end users to override the control system to manually prime the pump. In this example, we'll disable this option. Select the required input sense to stop the pump. The input sense refers to the status of the signal required to implement the control action. In this example, we're making the selection for control input of stop pump. We change it to low. This means that if the control signal is low, sometimes known as logic zero or off, then the pump will be stopped. This selection means with nothing connected, the pump will not run due to the low input. If the input sense is set to high, then it will need an appropriate voltage applied to the pump in order to apply the control action to stop. Refer to the instructions for more information. Select the home screen to exit the menu. You should now see a red square icon on the display, which indicates a stop input condition. To configure the digital outputs, select menu. Select control settings. Navigate to configure outputs and select. There are four digital outputs which relate to the four output relays on the end module, or the four open connector outputs on the upper D connector. In this example, we will configure output one. Here we can assign a function to the output. In this example, we will choose run status. Choose your output sense. In this example, we are choosing pump running equals high. The output sense refers to the status of the output signal when it is signaling the activity of the control condition you have selected. In this example, we are selecting for the output sense pump running, and we leave it set as high. This means that if the pump is running, the open collector output signal will be high, sometimes known as logic 1 or on. If you have a pump with an end module, it means the selected relay will be energised when the pump is running. Select home to exit. And that's it. Thanks for watching.